Good morning, everyone. Welcome on into North Dakota today. What began as a side hustle has now developed into an incredible business. Grazing Queen's owner and operator Alexandra Lunseth joining us for a holiday demonstration. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. For those who are true fans, we had you on for a nice spooky charcuterie on our Halloween extravaganza. Yes. The season has changed, and so have the goodies. Yes. But we're still learning how to get our hands on an incredible. Uh, snack, really. Mm -hmm. So tell yeah. us what's going on. An edible holiday centerpiece. I'm going to show you all how to create one. Okay, this is exciting. Yes, so you can find these at, um, you know, any local craft store. And what you do is you will wrap it around with It's like saran. foam, right? Yes. Okay. Yep. Yep. Like a floral foam. Got it. Um, and for this centerpiece, we will be using strawberries. So, if you'd like to help me here. I would love to. And then, I just do want to reiterate, she wrapped it in the plastic, so then nothing, everything's mm -hmm. protected, right? Right, So right. then we can just pull freely as we snack and graze. Right. So, okay. what you do is you will... Take your toothpicks here, okay. poke it in, and start at the base. Okay, so the non-pointy side going into the stem. Yes, Got you it. don't want to prick your thumb when you're pushing it in there. Okay. Starting again at the base. Is this ahead. too long? No, nope, oh, it'll okay. work. Okay. Um, you may have to hold the other side in case oh, it pokes through. Oh, through. Yeah. Okay. Good thinking. Mm -hmm. It's almost like she knows exactly what she's doing, you guys. Almost. <laughs> Sometimes. Okay, cute. Yes, yes. So you just continue this, and there's no necessarily right or, you know, wrong way to do this. Sure. We're just kind of filling in the green. Fill it in. Go around. But the best part is that it is green if it even shows through. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, and, I mean, that's a good point. If this is white, you can find some red or green saran this time uh -huh. of year. Too. She thinks of everything. Yeah. So while we're doing this, tell us your information for folks who want to reach out and participate in classes or just yes. get involved. Yes, so what I do is I teach charcuterie workshops mm -hmm. and you can find all of that information on my website. Our next event will be held December 28th, 7 p.m. at the Olive Ann Hotel, downtown Grand Forks. Yay! Just in time for the new year. Yes, yes. You can learn how to charcuterie with me. <laughs> um, you can check out... That's what I do every time she's on. <laughs> yes, so I think we made, what, a salami rose the first time? Uh, uh, yes, we learned how to do the really fancy, like, rolling up of mm -hmm. the rose technique. Then last time we figured out how to make a severed dead hand. Yes, that for, was That was so for boring. Halloween, though. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. So what you'll do is you'll just continue this. Okay. But and then keep I layering on top too? Yes. Okay. I have one that is partway complete. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. Mm -hmm. Okay, love this. So Television magic. Beautiful. I'll get this one out of the way here. Okay, so it's the foam tree underneath. This is essentially what it's going to turn into once we keep yes, going. Yes, but it's not done. Okay. We will garnish this. Garnish is so important. Okay. Um, so look at this. Do, this is pineapple. Mm-hmm. <gasps> She I do have one there. Yep. Okay. All right. So Ooh, was this rosemary? There are yes, there are some gaps okay. here. What you do is you take your rosemary and you just fill in oh, all those little so spaces. Good. I know. It smells like Christmas. And time. if you don't have rosemary, let's say the store's out of it or you know it doesn't look right, um, you can use mint. We have some mint here. Ugh. Or sage. Smell that. Yes, so this good. is incredible. Ooh, this. Mm -hmm. Even looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. Very <laughs> like, look at it, it's nice. Yes, it's nice and fuzzy. Okay, so we're essentially just making branches. Yes, filling in all those gaps. Okay. And then I do have um, some mums. These are edible flowers. I get them from yeah. Gourmet Sweet Botanicals out of California. Okay. Grown and fresh. <gasps> beautiful. Mm -hmm. We'll put her right up at top. And you just adorn it with And beauty. then what's our gingerbread things right there? Or what Ooh, is this? Those are cookies. These are from Aldi. They are so good. They are seasonal items. Team Aldi. Go and buy all of them because <laughs> you will want them all year round. Run. Don't walk. <laughs> right. So. And then just, so basically get your favorite little snacks and little ingredients in yep. your fruit. And then you can help me here. Put sure. some grapes around the front. You can use any oh, fruit that I you see. would like. Yeah. I have grapes. Um, and then some berries. And stick some berries in there. And it's our nice little holiday centerpiece. Yes, this is something for the kids. You know, the holidays are all <laughs> about the kids. Have them do this while you're making dinner. And it's just it'll as keep fun for the adults. So yes. I'll cool. give you guys a secret. Yes. Okay, yes. how do they find your information to get signed up and learn all about Grazing Queens? Yes, Queen? you can find me at www.grazingqueens.com. Follow me on Instagram, Facebook. Yeah. Um, I think I'm most active on Instagram. Um, yeah. Okay, so all the information, from tutorials, my, everything. Well, I was going to say, from my point of view, the most complicated piece to get to make this work is the foam piece itself. Yeah. And that's just head to your craft store. 
Exactly. Get that. Walmart wrap it in probably your has wrap. it too. Yeah, so. and then you can just get your favorite and fruit and do what you love. Look the cookies. <gasps> Here we are. Last thing. I'll have you do this. Is it going to snow? It's going to snow. Make it snow. <laughs> do I have to tap the top? There's a technique, isn't yep. there? <gasps> That. She is beauty. She is grace. This is a Christmas time icon, everybody. <laughs> I love this. This yes. is so fun. I told you it's just as fun for the adults. Yes. Incredible, Alexandra. Thank Aww. you so much for coming on. Yes, thank you for having me again. Ah, beautiful. Okay, we got to get photos before we demolish this one and send her on her way. <laughs> awesome. Plenty more coming up right here on North Dakota today. Stick around, everybody.